he said, you that bitch gonna spit you out. So I don't want you watching that night. Oh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> What's good? What it do, you two? It's the Cozy Boys back again with another Cozy Vibes podcast, episode five. Man, my name is James, and as always, I got my other two special guests in the building. Hey, you already know my name is Jordy. <laughs> my name is Drew. And today we also got another <clears throat> special guest with us, the second guest that we've ever had on the show. Go ahead, tell me where some fucking bullshit. I just want to say, don't cut this shit out either. Oh I just want to say, I should be, I was, I'm a crayon, okay? I was supposed to be the first guest. No offense to you. But I, was <laughs> to be, I, was, I was supposed to be the first guest. But I'm already. Right. They told me that I was going to be the first guest, and I'm not the second guest, so. It's okay, well. Okay, this is Rodney. He, he's the first male guest <laughs> on the show. Uh, yes, it, doesn't it. it doesn't make it better. It he was supposed to be the first one, but you know, he was supposed to shout your Instagram too. You don't, don't want to let him know where to find you, right? You want to not Rodney O one. That's N O T R like Randy. O T. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> not Rodney O one, man. Where did Randy come from? Can't think of, <laughs> can't think of nothing else. I, so, I don't understand how, how you gonna do that, but not do it with all the letters. <laughs> in like Nickelodeon, O, like out T, like like why you didn't do it all? You just I was just doing it because it was the start of a new word. Because you know, now I'm just writing. See the breakup. You heard it there first, breakup. folks. Okay, so his name is R, like Randy. Anyways, my first question is. How is it like in Ohio? Because I don't know what the fuck is like. Yeah, how's school going and all that, bro? I just want to say here, Ohio is the worst state in the country. Ohio is dog awful. I hate everything about Ohio and everyone except like five people, if you're watching and like five people. Ohio sucks. Don't ever go there. I don't advise anybody to go to Ohio. Ever. For no reason. And why is it? It's boring. It sucks. And... The <laughs> The females. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> what do you do to uh, entertain yourself? Like, you play the game, you just hoop? If I don't play the game and I'm not working out, I'll find an anime to watch and I'll binge watch it. And that's all I do. Mm, nice. Anime? Well, how about basketball, bro? Matter of fact, I got, I got another question for you. Since you're a basketball player, obviously. If you had a real life 2K rating to give yourself, what are you giving yourself? Like, Say if like I'm in the going to the league or just like overall like right now in college a college rating or NBA rating like overall rating because like since like if I like since if I get my yeah okay because I can give myself like an eighty and then you put me beside Damian Lillard or something like that yeah college rating I give myself a cool say with confidence bro what you talking about fake niggas figure it out say with shit I give myself a cool eighty five eighty three eighty five so what can you do better to get your rating up shoot more not hesitate on my shot. Be more confident when I get in the game. Sometimes while I get in the game, it's like a whole bunch of bullshit will be going on, and I'll get in there pissed and just go in there and pass the ball around instead of like actually playing. Cause the game, like my coach limits my game. We can't shoot middies or one leg layups, so like I already be pissed going. Yes, yeah, game. I already be pissed going in the game. So, <laughs> so if you feel like you're the new system, do you feel like you could be better than what you is now? Yes. Mm. I feel you. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, but like tell me I don't I mean I care about you doing good in basketball but since I'm not in college you feel me I need you to tell me about the college experience to be honest because I know nothing well going to Hiram College it's not much of an experience would you go to Kent yeah I was about, I was about to get to it my bad go ahead tell me good but <laughs> <laughs> but, when I, <laughs> but when I like go to other colleges like Kent, like the top D ones and like their parties and shit, that shit is cool. It's, yeah, it's cool. I mean, it's I've already had a lot of freedom since like my junior year of high school. So like, so you already been there. Yeah, you already know yeah. See me, I'm going crazy. <laughs> I swear, I swear, I ain't done nothing. I ain't got. I, even this past summer, we was out, but we wasn't like out like I could have been out. Jeez. No, you was. You I'm was saying, out. Like, yeah, you was yeah, out. I wasn't out. Y'all was out. Like, I was in the best life. Oh, that big turn. Facts. I don't even do nothing for this shit. <laughs> shit. I was just driving around. I was happy with that shit. Just get the fuck out of the 
damn hunch. You just have to go driving? Hell yeah, I mean, I got the damn hunch. I ain't had no hoes back then. Back then? Last year. You got a whole football roster now? <laughs> I got a quarterback. <laughs> <running back. laughs> hey. If I need to hand that bit off, I gotta run the back. <laughs> that bit off. Wow, shit, shit. We got it all. We got the defense ready. Shit. We got a whole squad out of it. I know this man do though. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Big yeah. Oh yeah. Y'all don't know RJ's that guy. He's really him. He's like, not better than me, but he I got inspired got. to be like him. First of all, I inspired. Ugh. I inspired to be like him. <laughs> Julius has potential to be him, but like I said in the beginning, Julius is pussy, so. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I have no. I have no roster. Oh my gosh, RJ. Ladies, if you're seeing this, he's he's single. He's not claiming none of the meal. So I know y'all watching this for him right here. He's not claiming. Now that I'm here, you know your last name. Fat. We be talking about you in the group chat too. <laughs> no, I'm just lying. I'm just lying. Nah, he ain't lying. Hey, y'all. Nah, ain't dry snitching on nigga. Nah, bro. Like he know you doing. Nah, but he be talking. Everybody get talked about in the group chat. No cap. That's Everybody. True. You. Niggas who thought that shit, you put that shit on? No, we talk about you. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, that's no disrespect, though. No, I mean, disrespect, yeah. that is disrespect. We talk about you. How you feel about it? We just be talking about this shit. Dudes can't dress them. It's just horrible. They shit but some people, don't like, some people don't like phone runs that you got on. Hey, it's a trend now, so you really can't say nothing now. Everybody got them on. So you, just, so you follow trends is what you're saying? No, I like them personally. You do? Yeah. It's fit, it's different. Comfortable, better than Crocs. So that's why. But, I, but some people can't afford those. Though. Hmm. I mean, if you can't afford it, I understand sticking with Crocs. You know, it's just a higher I'm trying to say we price broke? range. No, I'm not saying <laughs> that you broke, bro. You think you're bougie? No, I think you're better than everybody. That's not what I'm saying. Right you can't just walk around. Oh, 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 I still wear Crocs. Ain't no broke boy. <laughs> I still wear Crocs. I just like it. You took off some farm runs in two days. This nigga is <laughs> so, so, this nigga <laughs> is so rich. <laughs> this nigga, the bottom half of his fucking room costs way more than my shit. Like, this nigga costs I don't want like, no one to rob I got shit in my closet. This is one of the richest niggas I know. Like, this is not Like, true. we're in his house right now. This is a whole room dedicated just for this. <laughs> Like, come on now. This nigga got a pee. Do you see this nah. setup? Do you see all these mics? I can afford one of these. <laughs> and you have four. Bro. Bro, you're rich. Nigga, we pay for this. What did you talk about? <laughs> <laughs> okay. yes. oh, you thought you was paid for all them niggas got money, though. Have you? All they houses? <laughs> Big deal. Bro, you got a real long TR right now. Like, who are you talking about right now? And you had, you just had dumb something. And you got a cool like, 300. First of all, don't you got like five? Fast. I'm the cheapest nigga. Don't here. you got like, no, don't you got off white fours? And Supreme Fives? Ain't. So let's go now. Let's go now. Who really has money? Y'all three. Y'all. No, y'all. you do. Y'all three. How many B-Long T's you got? Four. That's it. It couldn't be me. That's four. That's so, a hundred dollars each. Nah, one of them was on sale for 60. <laughs> 60 for a t-shirt? This one was 90. It's not a hundred. Huh? With tax. No. <laughs> <laughs> got it, man. Got it, man. <laughs> it's not bad. See, think about it, though. If I get this money, I'm going to spend it on this V-Loan, take a picture, or I'm going to spend it on food when I can just cook at home. I'm going to go cook and buy my V-Loan and look cute for the ground. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean. <laughs> yeah, just hop on that. <laughs> I don't know. So, you know, um, <clears throat> do, y'all, do y'all like taking pictures? I can't take it. No, since you're talking about Instagram. I hate taking it. I be wanting to so bad. I, I literally, I can't get comfortable taking them, bro. I, I feel like, like to take pictures. Please go um, look at the Instagram. I take a lot of pictures. I feel like, um, I'm just not. <laughs> Don't mind him. <laughs> just this, a silly goofy this, move right Just now. a silly goofy He's move. just in a silly goofy This is first right time. Now. Anyways. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what was you going to say about? Uh, fuck. I just feel like. Clothes never been my number one priority. But see, the thing is, you can dress though, and you're not an ugly nigga. You can post pictures. I'm saying, but 
I'm saying like it was never my first priority. Like it was like till now I noticed like I don't really don't got shit. So like every time I try to say look, it's just some extra shit I gotta fucking pay for. I gotta pay for my fucking braces, like three hundred dollars because I lost my shit. I'm like damn, I gotta pay for that shit. I pay for fucking car notes and shit. I'm like damn, bro, I just don't have time to get no clothes. But like I feel like after this year I should be straight because man I don't really gotta worry about anything because I'm gonna have my shit saved up already. But with the clothes you do have already, because you did go on that little spree where you bought a bunch of shoes and clothes. I did, true. but but that is true. I feel like I feel like we're all in the group chat. I got some. Every shirt you got, it was your own. It was your own. It was because of James. I was not going to show off, but it was because of James. I feel like he said I was the worst dressed in this bitch. I remember that. I felt highly disrespected. I felt highly disrespected. Just remember, James wears purple with green. Yeah, if you go to this nigga Instagram, I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't know what the fuck you got on. But anyways, we're not gonna talk about him. I'm just My saying. Instagram? Yes, yeah, your Instagram. Bro, why you defending Instagram? I'm saying the pictures I got up there is not bad, though. James. It's on it's on two of them. James, let's be honest. So the fit was bad? So the fit was bad? Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. In my Instagram? Oh, hold on. Okay, I'll pull it up. I'm finna go to. I'm already on the way. Okay. It's gonna be on the screen right here. Cause if, if anything you cap at it, cause you told me you been look good. Okay, the one that you took when we were outside by veterans, that's a good picture. <laughs> yeah. I'm talking about the one yeah, when you James that came to our orientation when you just yeah, no, you could have you couldn't. I didn't post that one. We talked about one. That was straight. The, 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 that's one on Instagram. When you did the parking lot, you had a beanie on. It's, I'm, it was, I think it was oh, that one. Yeah, that's a good picture, right? That's all though. That's but fit was another one to me. It was a basic fit. So this is <laughs> this is that dude hard, bro. I mean, already, it yeah, wasn't yeah, this one. Yeah. Already, it's not it was bad. I get this. Yeah, yeah. Cool. he probably took it. Down. You took one of them down, like that. You took one. You told when he was smiling when he had a church shirt on. <laughs> that, I was like, that, this that was eleventh grade. <laughs> this, 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 that was eleventh grade. This, this was the time. No, because oh, no, 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 no. Because I remember because you was talking about I couldn't dress. And I was like, all right. So I, one time it was me and Delonte in the room. I was looking at this nigga Instagram. I said, this nigga's talking about me. What is this <laughs> bullshit on his, this on his Instagram? I'm like, right. I felt highly disrespected. But I just feel like I don't have no pants. Like, bro, pants do not fit me. Like, I had to. The only time a store had my size of pants was in fucking Florida. And I did not have enough money for that shit. <laughs> I'm like taxing $100 for a goddamn parking ticket. Like, what the fuck I look like? Man. I was broke as fuck, man. So shit. Yeah, man. I feel like you can fit pants if you pull them down. So you be having them bitches at your belly button. Bro, you might. Like, everybody don't say it. Right, bro. Everybody don't say it. You don't got it sad, but the belly button, nigga? My shit is like up here. Y'all don't understand, like, my shit, my hip bones like up here. <laughs> that is crazy. <laughs> And look at your legs, bro. <laughs> that, that shit literally is gonna be at my ass. Like the way you want me to wear my shit, like nigga, if I wore my shit like this, this how niggas expect me to wear my shit. Like, nigga, look, look at my my whole bro, ass. Is bro, bro, put the buttons Why up. Why you got the buttons? Put the buttons up. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Move the camera. <laughs> <laughs> this man grabbed both cheeks, lifted them up. Like, bro, no. I mean, I just gotta let y'all know. I mean, y'all niggas, y'all niggas, that's what y'all expect me to wear my shit at. All the way down to. I wasn't expecting shit. nothing. That's, that's, what all was, that's all I saw. That's all I saw. He said, "Pull my shit down." All right, pull my shit down. That far down? High. Yes, it's that high. Like every time I saw someone, they're like, "Damn, your shit high as fuck." <laughs> like, duh, bitch. Like you think I just got my shit up here for no damn reason? Like I'm damn Steve Urkel. You talking about your jeans? Yes. Right. You know <laughs> the jeans that you wore in Florida? I'm like, they look high. Like I, I, I <laughs> but obviously you felt normal, but they did look kind of high. You weren't sagging. I see what you're talking about. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's okay, Joe. Just take the nose, okay? Yeah. Just take the sweatpants, man. <laughs> Jeans ain't for you, my boy. Hey, pipe down. You go. And fuck around in there. I just never could have found none, but don't, don't worry. I told you next year, you're not going to get right. Where you going? Nigga, try to try me on fucking camera. And where you going to get them from? The rich ass motherfucker. <clears throat> where you going to get the pants from? I suggest H&M. Hell no. <laughs> I went to that store. They, they had none of my shit. My pants size. I'm like, hey, damn, but they got like Jane type size shit pants. I mean, I Why do you always be putting my name in it? Bro. I'm just, I mean, you a small ass nigga. So <laughs> I'm, like, I'm not small. You short? I'm not short. I'm average size. I need to start playing. Facts, I'm Oh, yeah, to the yeah, females, yeah. I'm 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 very short, especially when I walk around with y'all all day. Ooh, no, y'all don't help at all. Yeah, okay, first of all, stop that. I'm saying like collectively I mean, as a whole. Yeah, I got him by a good two, three inches. That's not that. That's not that much. 
I got this nigga by like seven inches. Julius got me by like three inches. That's not that much, but he's tall, right? And I'm short, right? So what's the difference? So he got you. Mm-hmm. Yes, it's like three inches, two, three inches. If you six foot and he's six two, yeah, that's just two inches. And if I'm five eleven, that's still only three. And I said I got dance by like two or three, so I'm five nine. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna turn that out of the video. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, no one on five nine eight. <laughs> <laughs> Pitch yourself and say you six feet tall. <laughs> nah, facts. I'm six foot. I'm not. <laughs> I ain't gonna count like that, bro. Cause I don't care. I don't care. No you could get. You could go get them heel boosters. Like they boost your height. Like no count. Alright, but that didn't make fun of you, bro. <laughs> no, I'm just, <laughs> don't, I know they are. They <laughs> thought no, they were there. I know they are. No, no, like you could be like one of them catfish, like you. Bro, I don't see. I know a nigga who's five eight, and he tells every girl on Tinder that he's six one. See, like, I would never do And they still like be that. pulling up on him. Yes, they're disappointed. They'll be pissed. They still yes, yes they'll be pissed off. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He be fucking some of that's that crazy, though. They don't be caring that much. It's not really about the hype for real. Nah, it really is. <laughs> some dude be telling that shit shit. Like, Fact. you smaller than me? I don't want no smaller than me. I want a short king. That's <laughs> smaller. It's smaller than a female. <clears throat> it's like, that's wild. You know what I'm saying? Would you Would you do that? Let my female be taller than me? Yeah. No. <laughs> I ain't no damn him barely neither. Like, You're taller know. than um. Kate? Yeah, I'm taller than Kate. Who? I don't. He said K. K. I don't really say names. You could you could bleep it out. Like, <laughs> she had high heels on, didn't she? <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Did y'all take prom pictures? She was. Yeah. She mm, was. Did she uh, I think, I think, I think, I So you're, you're taller than I'm, 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 I'm
What if I want to put them back? This man. Okay, next question. I said that question. Nah, I want to put them back. Who's your favorite? Who's my favorite? Mm. You don't have to say. Nah, no, I'm gonna say. Okay, keep going. Give me like ten seconds. All right, you don't even gotta say the name. You just gotta stay with the start with. But okay, my favorite. I said it was probably Kia. It was probably Kia too. It's probably my favorite. Oh. I would say really. winter, but like we didn't really date. Yeah. Cause like, yeah, that's your favorite. Yeah, we're for right? like five years, but that's what it's I know that was your favorite baby. Bro. It was like six. Joe, you're not five. talking to winter. <laughs> I'll beat your fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga really tried her. Like, I really did you? it. And then they had the audacity to put this nigga in her home room, like. <laughs> <laughs> and I ain't talked to that bitch not once. Facts. Every time she would send me a selfie, home. this nigga was in it. I did not like. I that was not. <laughs> Facts, I don't remember. Like what she took picture, picture I, I wish I could find it. I don't even recall being in the picture of that bitch. Because you sat at her table. Oh, I did. <laughs> and then she took a picture of me and shit. I ain't want to be in that shit. I hear you. Yeah, that shit. So, uh, that's your bit. Control your bit. Nah, she got a nigga. She got a nigga. That's not my bit. Oh, that's... She, I stopped talking to her in, what, ninth grade? So, how you felt with uh, <laughs> your teammate? <laughs> I mean, shit, I don't really give a fuck. Care. No, I don't care. Mm-hmm. Shit like that don't really be getting to me for real, because, like, that's good. Yeah, no. That's how you mindset. I like, can't let these hoes take over your life. No, because if, like, if, like, look at me. If one of my two. <laughs> if one of my two. I feel like you're written that towards me. No, I was not. I just I just turned my head, you know, but you know, it went on you, but then, I mean, your big guy. Anyways, you ever been in a heartbroken <laughs> you set yourself up. You did bring it up. You did bring it you up. Did For set you set really up. People that don't know what we're talking about, Julius got his girl so in. You know what I'm saying? I tried to save him. We tried to stop it. He brought it on so. back. But the cat's out the bag. I love with D bag. D one athlete in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, right, right. he said, he said have, have you ever been heartbroken? Yeah, a few times. That's why I'm the way I am now. Okay, so describe how that was for you. It's terrible. It was like, it was like, damn, this hoe really don't love me. That's how she loves me. Also, I I never thought I was the type of person to have feelings. You know, that's because I hide it now. Yeah, you hide it. So, breaks. so, so, when it did happen. What was like? What was your main thing that you go to to make yourself cheer up? Juice World, Juice World, Juice World helped me a lot with that. So how you felt when he died? You like, damn. Well, yeah, I, just, I, you know? I, I dropped a few tears when he died. I'm not gonna mm-hmm. cap. I was upset. You don't, you don't, so like when you going through all the emotions, do you think like do you think you hoop better? Nah, sometimes like if I'm too fucked up, I will hoop terribly. Yeah. yeah, I know exactly how you feel because like when I was at one Robin, bro. That bitch said she was gonna spit on me, and I was thinking about that the whole game. <laughs> I was starting, and I was thinking about that, that whole game. I said, if this bitch spit on me, I'm gonna hit her. I'm gonna give her. And that was the only thing I, I had zero points in the game, so shit, I mean, shit. You know, see, like, when I hoop better off of emotions, I say, like, a nigga gotta talk shit to me and piss me off. Like, say if a nigga talk shit and score me, and I, like, get mad, then I'll hoop better. But, like, if I go in the gym pissed off at a, at a female or some shit, nah, I'd be fucked up. So what's like your pet peeve? Like how they how how do females like piss you off like that? It's like a lot now. <laughs> it's a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> Listen, it could be like the little things, like, like tricky. Well, apparently I'm OCD, which I don't think I'm OCD, but apparently I am. So like in my dorm room, I got all my shit on my desk set up exactly how I want it. I don't move mm. it. <laughs> so if, if a, move it. I remember specifically one female was in my room. Never been so mad at my... This is one I think I told you about. It was somebody. Yeah. yeah she, she was bad. Yeah. yeah. She had the audacity to take <laughs> all of my stuff and just like, just move it. Just randomly pick something. What is this? Like, bitch, it's a fucking... Uh, it's I, a I, hairbrush. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, mean, I, I, I never understood like why they get so mad. But like, it's like everybody with OCD when they have something organized how they want it, and as soon as they get moved, they get mad. And I noticed that. Yeah, like, and then I was like, bro, I said I turned on my show. I said, don't touch my controller. <laughs> and I sat my controller down. I'm laying there, and she she gets up. I'm gonna go use the restroom. Walks to the door, and then runs back and grabs the controller and goes and puts it on my other desk across the room. Yeah, all right. <laughs> yeah, no, I feel you. I'm not. Like, I think you're kind of OCD, but I'm kind of the same way. Like, if I set something up in the same way, 
I wanted to be exactly where I left it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I feel you on that one. I don't think I was this bad, though, until I got to college. I don't know mm. why. I don't think I got OCD. I just feel like, <clears throat> if I just feel like um something needs to be organized, I'm going to organize it. <laughs> so, I don't even think I got I can't, OCD. I'm the same way, bro. I'm yeah. the same way. Like, so I can't even say that. It's like, shit could be, like, out of place. I'm going to just got to just put it somewhere to make it look better or something. I don't know. That's funny, but I don't like how y'all got it. If somebody moved to get pissed. Nah, I, I, I think RJ really is OCD. I remember you. I remember first time you came over to my room at my old house. I had like some <laughs> crayons or like some pens or something, but they were just like sprawled all over the the desk or whatever. Aren't you like, nigga? What are you doing? They picked up every single pen and put it, and he color coded. I'm like, bro, okay. So I'm like, I'm pretty sure you got at least some type of formula because you was like, bro, like, God, niggas make me mad, bro. This little nigga, bro. Oh my gosh, I used to hate for the come to the nigga. I remember one time. I know exactly what you're gonna say. I bet you do. We like fucking eight and nine. I took a fucking shower. Before I came to his fucking house, <laughs> literally <laughs> not even ten minutes before getting to his house, I took a motherfucking shower. I get to his house. Mm-mm, you're not sitting on my bed. <laughs> don't take a shower. I didn't let I nobody said, sit on my bed. I said, nigga, don't you don't give me the air matches, bro. I don't not give a fucking no <laughs> You wasn't allowed on my because I didn't know where the fuck you been. Like you said, you like I get it, I get it, but like. <laughs> Like, I'm finna sleep there, like, I on. get, no, bro. That's why I don't even, like, folks up in my house, bro. Yeah, like, I hate people at Even him, he's been in my house, like, four times total. Like, ever since I lived there for, like, three years. I've been over to his house, like, hundreds of times, but he only been over to my house, like, four times. I don't like people in my house. I remember one time, I forgot who it was, but he was in my house. Came in, sat on my bed. I'm like, okay, he still got jeans. I didn't say nothing. <laughs> I didn't say nothing. I'm trying to be a good host or whatever, you know what I'm saying? That's my parents always tell you, you know what I'm saying? Be a good host or whatever. But I had jeans on, still on my bed. We just came from a game. I don't know what makes people think they can just get so comfortable in somebody else's bed. But then you start getting close up to where like I sleep, like my head. I could have sat on my pillow, bro. Like you don't do that, bro. Like that's why I don't, people, I don't, why I don't like people in my house. So bro. funny because these two niggas are the main ones when they come to my shit. Fucking my shit. This nigga. <laughs> that's because he won't be giving a fuck. Uh, it's, <laughs> but it's crazy because these niggas like this, but they do it. Oh, like, like, no, I don't. I don't sit on I don't sit on nobody else's pillow, bro. You can't name one. No, I don't sit on pillows. That's on me, I, have, I sit on any of it. I no, sit on the same place in the bed every single time. He fought in my bed one time, bro. I was so mad. <laughs> what the fuck you want me to do? Get up, pillow, run bro. to the corner of the room and go fart? Like, no. You like, put your butt cheeks on my pillow, bro. Remember that? Because I made you mad. Oh, so, really? <laughs> <laughs> you put your pants down, grab a pillow, and sat on it and farted and got the red. <laughs> That's like ninth grade, bro. My ass was clean. <laughs> I would no, I would never forget that day, bro. I was so mad. And I bet he still used that video. <laughs> 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 So I don't want you watch it that night. Oh, oh, night. Night. oh, oh my God. He, 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 he did not watch it that night. <laughs> that bitch got a peep out the next day. Good laugh. got the same funk on it from night grade. Come on, nigga. My name was in there, but y'all got it, man. I watched it the same night. Stay face out. <laughs> That nigga had a fart pillow. You fart on that nigga pillow for real? No, I fart on the bed. I oh my god, that was bro. so disrespectful. You got your pillow, fart on it, and then ran away. And slept on that bitch. Yeah. Same night. No. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, thought it said, yeah. I thought he said, yeah. Oh, bro. shit. Nah, bro. Right. God. You can't do that. That was disrespectful. Yeah, talk to him. No, I don't do that. Rest Ain't no fart on nobody. Bro, bro. Nah. I wouldn't do it again. That was childish. You probably would. No, nah, I wouldn't do that again. No, he. The fact that you say you ran away after you did it, I'm like, okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't like, recall running right away. away. Julius is not the big bad fucking wolf, but I definitely did it. Uh-oh. Sounds fresh. I'm not even going to say nothing, bro. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. You want to keep going? I ain't got time. Oh, wow. You know I like to instigate sometimes, too. Yeah, you should, too. You know what we said? What were we talking about? We were talking about winter peeves. in middle school. Oh, that's what I was thinking about though. We was talking about pet peeves. Yeah. But I was saying like middle school. Remember when you got in that fight, bro? <laughs> I didn't get in a fight. I was Ooh, about to throw a chair. About to, I was about to throw. A chair. Oh, I, I thought you threw it, bro. Nah, nah. I was dragging the chair, and then the bitch cut me. <laughs> Look, let me tell you the story. <laughs> so this nigga was talking <laughs> shit. No, <laughs> I was. Oh my God. He was talking Get shit. He was like, "Oh God, you ain't finna do nothing." I saw the fuck wrong with this nigga. So I grabbed the chair and I started rolling one way. 
and a big bit is cutting me off. She's like, no, RJ, you need to fight. And he's in the background. He's like, see, oh, God, you only going that way because you know she's going to cut you off. You ain't trying to fight real. So I so for all this nigga. So I picked up the chair, and I started going around the other way. And then as soon as I got close to him, then um, the teacher grabbed me. Yeah, they, it was a white teacher. They put his ass behind the desk. I remember this, like, you was in there? Yes. That shit was <laughs> fucking hilarious. It, they, they put this nigga. Well, it was like a blind nigga. Wait, can you, he couldn't hear him. Or no, the uh, teacher. He was oh. deaf one. Oh, that nigga? Yeah. Man, we gonna talk about that nigga after this. Oh this nigga used to always put me in the fucking in the he used to cubicle. Yeah, a cubicle by this myself. Funny all the time by this stank ass fucking this ferret. Is, this is when me, him, and Winter was in the same class. So as soon as he got behind that cubicle, I would sit right next to oh Winter. My God. This nigga would get so fucking mad. But he was trying to put the joy in my fucking day. <laughs> Jordan, get away from me, bitch! <laughs> He would get so mad because I'd be right next to him. This nigga was in there for like two weeks. I thought he was going to be in there for a month, but he was in there for like two weeks. Nigga was trying his best to get out that damn cubicle, but he wanted to go right next to him, but I know he wanted what, what he wanted to do too. Little horny ass. <laughs> I, I think that's when it all started. <laughs> I didn't know because Arthur was really in love, bro. I remember, I remember when you got in trouble and you was in ISS for like however many days. Like two weeks? Yeah, for like two weeks. I remember one time he was after school. I don't know why, but Winter was there. We talked to him. He came from my with Horace. He looked at her and she was on the other side. Of, we was all talking. She was on the other side of the group. And you was over here. He looked at her. He said, Hi. And he just gave her a hug. I'm like, Oh, dude. That's, that's so lovely. I knew this nigga was in love because when I went to the nigga house, this nigga was texting me a bit on Trivia Crack. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, she wasn't allowed to date or text niggas, so we download the trivia crack and we play a game and then text for like an hour after and then play a game and then. What? <laughs> <laughs> I have never, never heard of that. The only way I could text her. I have never heard of I used to either. stare at my, I used to turn my phone on and keep it on until she would respond. Facts. I would be there just watching the nigga on trivia crack. I'm like, nigga, why is you on trivia crack? It's 24 7. Oh, it takes one turn. <laughs> I don't, know why, I don't know why any of them niggas think I sound like that or thought I sound like that when I was little, but I did not talk like oh, that. Oh, this nigga. No, my voice was high. This nigga was little as fuck. I was like five feet. Winter was taller than me. She's five feet tall now. She was taller than me in eighth grade. That's crazy. Mm. Damn, son. <laughs> How do you feel about the parents? Do you think we the best group out? We most definitely are the best group out. Like y'all said earlier, they said this. I didn't notice this, but... We threw a party at my house, and it was a boxing match party. We were gonna have um, like what six people? It was six people. It was gonna be a boxing tournament, yep. and I got to pull my guys. So it was gonna be a pool party, you know, boxing match. We said it. We posted about the party two days prior to. Yeah. It rained. The party was at say the party was at ten. I don't remember, but say the party it was at ten. At like it rained at like nine fifty. Was still deep. Still and it deep. rained for like thirty minutes. Yeah, bro. Bro. and it was hard. That's how you know we <clears throat> like that. Yeah, we're like, and we was a bit on canceling too. I remember that. He's a bird, just cancel, bro. Yeah, no, we no, were no, gonna no, cancel. No, yes, we was dead ass from the yes. We was, they was finna leave and shit, but then we stayed and we pushed through, and then it got deep as fuck. some dumbass bitch who can't fucking drive. Oh. Rolled down my nose. <laughs> <laughs> nah, because that shit pissed me off. She <laughs> rolled the fucking party. She pissed me off. Look, we having a good time. It's just not getting deep. It's just not getting deep. And some dumbass lady. First of all, it's a street road, <laughs> and cars are on the side of the road, right? Cars on the side of the road. How the fuck? I don't know if I could do this if I tried. How the fuck do you hit five parked cars in total, each and every one of them? That, that was bad. crazy. It was, it was, it was that, that was bad. Crazy. Like, that I don't bad. know how that happened. I don't even know how that's possible. They fucked up. Like, every car was literally like... It looks like the Hulk came and pushed each car in the ditch. Facts. Like, I'm not even going to to you, but that shit it was really bad. fucked up. Like... You wouldn't even think like a nigga would do that. Like, it looked like they was even, they couldn't even go that fast because they're coming out the driveway. The speed limit on my street is thirty five fucking miles per hour. So like so like they <laughs> they gotta come out like five miles per hour. If that it looked like them them niggas ran into that shit like a hundred miles per hour. Oh god, shit. had to be fast as hell. And they coming out the driveway like nigga, the driveway wasn't even that far. It's like probably like five steps and you're to the next car. Like I don't even know how they did that. That shit was like really ridiculous. I don't know what she was on. Hey, but if you want to be a boxer in the next video, just let me know. Yeah, we're gonna. We're run definitely that for sure. gonna run that back next summer. Next summer, no humble uh, shit. No, no, I mean no cocky shit. But like, it's gonna be. It's gonna be. No, I didn't say. I said no, 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 no humble. No. I said humble. Oh, okay. No, I didn't no. say no homo. I'm. I meant to say no cocky shit, but I'm some humble shit. That shit was literally gonna be deep as fuck. It was like it was. four cars pulled up, and we were gonna start the first shoot. match. Oh yes. Yeah. 
I forgot. Yeah. It was getting real deep. It was only getting deeper, too. We had a nigga out that bit practice. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, oh, yeah, we don't, we don't do nothing but professional fights. <laughs> <laughs> we got like, real boxes out here. Like, it, it, it was so deep, like. The fucking police officers are like so far away. Like I literally yeah. had to take a run to the big car <laughs> just to get some. <clears throat> so yeah, I got some chocolate from this bitch from the car. <laughs> it was like a long ass run. I was like, I was like, where you at? She's like, I'm behind the uh, police car. I'm like, damn, that bitch far. Fuck, I'm in that bitch running. I got tired of fuck, but I thought I was in there marathon running for that bitch. I was like, damn, but they was deep as hell in that bitch, ain't it? Yeah, it was. Deep. It was like 15 cars deep, and you gotta think it's a narrow road, so it was already just look packed anywhere. And more yeah, cars pulling up at the same time. Yeah, it was my driveway. Yeah, my fucking yard was packed too. And we had VIP parking. We was in the driveway. And the, I and felt the, a little special. Yes, and the most correct thing about it, his dad said, "Do not bring that many people." <laughs> in fact, our dad is inviting thirty people. His parents have no idea, bro. Then we just showed up. Thirty people, shit. It was probably like fifty. I'm talking about like to begin with. It was finna be deeper Look, than that. You like, no, bro. I'm not gonna tell them, but they'll find out. I don't care. <laughs> they said have, I think they said like thirty or forty people or some dumb shit like that. Like first of all, six people alone is the boxers. The other six is us. Like come on now, that's already yeah, that is, that that's already true. twelve people. And I want some females to come. And it's gonna be a bunch of <laughs> niggas there betting on it, side bets and shit. This it was gonna be side bets. Yeah, there's black side bets. The side bets was gonna go crazy because I was gonna bet on Keith and make a lot. Oh of yeah, money. Keith. Ooh, cute. Hey, that nigga practicing for two hours. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Kyrie, you're you're gonna fight him again. Just uh, yeah, yeah, we're definitely running back. We're, we're definitely yeah. yeah, would you would you would you do a boxing match? You know how like uh uh YouTubers and stuff been doing that stuff now. You know what I'm saying? They be doing like celebrity boxing matches. I do. You would do it. You well, would do it yeah, I would, but I, I can't it. do anything because my two front teeth are still kind of hanging up. No, right now we're just talking about like, would you ever do it? Oh yeah, you box? Yeah. I don't know. I'll get paid for it, so I ain't sure. Yeah, I feel like boxing is fun. So it would be fun. It's a horror. There's a lot of conditioning, man. A lot. Conditioning. Yeah, twelve right. rounds, bro. What? Yeah, no, I'm not trying to get twelve rounds. No. No, nah, like for probably for celebrities, probably like three or four. Yeah. Like the other day when um <clears> the two boxers, yeah, they yeah, yeah. pray guard. Hey, that nigga, Darren wins. Bro, he, he was stoning he got, around, he, bro. Yeah, he got the NFL from community <laughs> community looking bad out there. That's one of the like biggest running backs, top running backs, and you let Frank these, Warwood? Yes, and you let one of these point guards. Darren Williams. That was a point guard? Darren Ronald Williams was a point guard, bro. He was on Team USA. You don't know Darren Williams? He looked familiar. I didn't know his position was a point guard. Yeah, I was about to say, he's big as fuck. He, he, not a shooting guard, not a small forward, not a power forward, not a center, a point guard. And you're a running back, running through middle linebackers, big ass niggas. You let this point guard ass nigga sleep you? Bro, no. Y'all watch the Jake Paul fight? That, that rigged ass shit. You think it was rigged? I'm gonna show you a video that's gonna change your mind. I'm gonna show you right now. Right, he Big, no, but I'm gonna show you a video. Like, I'm gonna show you a video. Like, there was a time when he dropped Watch his hand video. and he put it back up and dropped it again. That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna show you this video. Yeah. He braces for the impact and everything. Watch how he drops his hand and then he braces for impact. I mean, yeah. but, I, but you look could, how he braces. But you could have thought. I mean, but oh, he braced, yeah, 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 he braced for it. It's so, awesome, like though. Like he went like that. But, like, but like, if you're just fighting, his hand if you box, you this, see that. But he's a, he's if a you see him coming, fighter. then why would you move your hand down? He's a UFC, he's a UFC, he's a UFC, UFC fighter. fighter. Yes. Yeah. So why would he look at him and drop his shit and then brace? That's, his that's shit what I'm saying. You're not gonna do it and then brace. Like you're gonna do. You're gonna brace. Yeah, this that's your first. Like maybe he probably know the body shot too. That that's another thing. Even if you thought it was a body shot, he could have went like this. Oh yeah, something. I don't know. I know. I don't protect my face before my body. True say. I mean, it's hard, but like I just want to see him fight a real boxer because if he really fight a real boxer, he's gonna get his ass. I saw a TikToker who's a real boxer, and he um. He was talking about how he would have whooped his ass and shit. So Jake Paul, Wait, everybody's saying how they be whooping Jake. Paul. No, but Jake Paul, <laughs> he has not. Jake Paul's him. fight. Um, his trainer was texting him, and there was he was posting all the screenshots and shit. He was talking shit. He was like, pull up. He sent the address and everything. And then the day of that, he was supposed to spar with him and shit. Yeah. The dude like blocked him and everything. Huh. So like he never wanted to like fight a real fighter. He just wanted to act like it. Like, like dude, if you look at his competition, it's really not shit. Like Nate Robinson, like nigga. <laughs> <laughs> He fought Floyd, but you know that was just a Man, fun. Floyd. that was Logan Paul, not Jake Paul. Jake Paul's the one with the tattoos. Why they look the same? Shit. Yeah, they do look. The same. Yeah. yeah, I get them confused I mean, all the time. And then he fought Willie. <laughs> that was Jake Paul who fought Teron Woodley. 
But Logan, yeah, yeah, I just Logan Paul is a taller one with more hair though. Jake Paul yeah, got fans. Yeah, so you probably the Woodley, Paul. fucking Nate, and who else was it? Oh, I don't even know. I used to think Jake Paul was gay. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Disclaimer. I don't have a problem with gay people because I do remember a time I was trying. <laughs> yeah, let's to put that out there. Good, yeah, good, we're good, we're good job, RJ. Good we're job. Gonna cut it out. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> yeah, just keep going. I remember I was talking to a girl on the Hiram College basketball team, Kelsey. I'm saying names. I was trying to talk to you or whatever, and I forgot what I posted. <laughs> 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 but it was like it was something about gay people, and I swear to God, I wasn't trying to down gay people. It was like a joke, like a joke. And, like, she got mad. She was like, what are you talking about? Like, I guess she's, like, high in pride. Like, she's not gay, but she's, like, supports it so much because I guess one yeah. of her friends are gay. But, yeah. like, I wasn't downing them at all. And she got so mad. And then since then, she was just dry text the hell out of me. And then, like, three days later, she was like, I think we should just be friends. Like, I knew it. I, I see. This is my problem. With I don't have no problem with it. But, like, if you're trying to, like, make me, like, feel like I need to be friends with them or, like, feel like obligated to do something with him like i'm not gonna do all that like that's that's not really like my type of thing i feel like i can't even post on social media about it no more because this this new era is just so sensitive like if i post yeah. a picture of you and i'm like damn this nigga gay as hell <laughs> like i'm gonna have like 15 females down me like damn it's a joke yeah. fuck around with y'all <laughs> <laughs> and they want to be equal but like if you joke on them like they'll take it the wrong way like no i really don't I have no problem with it. It's not like they don't come along with me. I don't have no problem with it. But like, if you feel like I should be their friend, <clears throat> I'm, I'm I just I don't like personally how they treat the word gay and faggot, which I can see how that can be offensive. I also like how they treat those two words, like white people saying nigga and nigger. Like it's not the same. Like if you're gay, you're gay. You shouldn't get mad at me for calling you that because that's just the truth. Obviously, they say the truth hurts, but I'm not downing you for calling you gay. Because if you're gay, why does that upset you? Yeah, but if you say the other word, like I mean, that's just still like a word. like a slur. Like you know what I'm saying? Like nigger and nigga. You know what I'm saying? That's like a slur. Like people can still. I mean, I don't. I don't call. I don't call gay people faggots because I see. What yeah, no, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Like, but I'm like saying, using the word. Is really a difference? That's all I'm saying. What is the difference? I don't know the difference. Between what? Gay and faggot. Faggot sounds more disrespectful to me. Yeah, it's more like a slur. Like, gay more is like a describing word. Like, people are gay. Like, or like, L not, L I almost say elemental P. LGBTQ. But like, <laughs> I almost say elemental P. <laughs> like, like, LGBTQ. Like, that's like more describing. Word. Like, F, like, fag is like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, disrespect. Like, you're calling them out their name, like, in a bad way. Mm -hmm. But I have no problem with gay people. I like everyone. What were we talking about before? Like, how did this, how did this work? I just thought about it. It just came to my head. He just no, but we was talking about something that made me like, no, nah, I ain't gonna talk about it. Oh, you talking about the female that you was talking about, uh, you said she wouldn't talk to you no more because you made a joke about gay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Kelsey? And then, damn, I really hope the wrong person don't see this. And then, um, Too late, not to Nah, I Ain't gonna say this. I know. <laughs> <laughs> ain't they gonna watch. <laughs> <laughs> ain't they gonna watch. <laughs> but then, um, yeah, that's it. So what's your pet peeve? <laughs> <laughs> Back to that. I said, um, people moving my shit when I, when I already got it set up. Mm -hmm. yeah. I hate, I don't know if this would be a pet peeve. I think this would be, um, females who can't communicate. Like, mm -hmm. or, that, say that. I say that or anybody, this pet peeve for anybody. If like, say if you, hear something about me and then you just run with it and say you're mad at me because of what you heard instead of addressing it to me. I hate that. Mm, so they had to believe somebody else rather than say yours. Yeah. Okay. Or just not even ask Yeah, not even ask Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Shit like that. Did that really have me out? Like rumors and stuff? Yeah, yeah still, it still like does, rumors but I never really go around about me. Like right. me personally. Another short story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Talk Back when I was me. talking to Anastasia. Cause I you watching. <laughs> Back when I was okay. talking to her. Because <laughs> <laughs> like, they were telling me about how she was sharing the videos and liking it and shit. I was like, fuck, weirdo. But, oh, chill, chill. No. But Love back you. when I was talking to her, um, I, I tried to end things with her nicely. I did. Because I'm not a mean person. Mm -hmm. And then she thought I was cheating on her because somebody, I still don't know who to this day, 
told her I was fucking the volleyball girl who I wasn't yet. I did, but I didn't. He said I wasn't at the time. <laughs> but oh my they, God. They, thought we was, <laughs> they said we was fucking, so she went and blocked me on Snapchat and everything without saying anything, without addressing it. And I was like, what the fuck wrong with you? Like, that shit's just annoying. Like, oh my God. <laughs> <she didn't listen. laughs> So she made me mad, and then I wouldn't fuck her because I was mad, but I didn't fuck her. Oh my god! <laughs> I didn't cheat is what I was getting at. They thought I cheated, but I didn't cheat. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> this nigga just said yet. Like, oh yeah, not yet. The bro. yet, the yet was only because they pissed me off and pushed me to do it. I was like, they pissed y'all. If they never would have made up that rumor, I, I would have never fucked that girl. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> yes, if you're if you're new, RJ like that. <laughs> like, like, it's nothing surprising to us, but like, he's I'm like, not like that. that. No, yeah. He's like that. Yeah, we we've been new to RJ. Yeah, we've been yeah, y'all new too, but we've been. I wouldn't expect him to say it on camera. Right? That means you know. <laughs> you know yeah, he, I wouldn't expect nothing. I was expecting more from the filter type of RJ, but I guess that side don't exist. I'm yeah. <laughs> 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 that nigga don't give a fuck. Oh, yeah, that saying. nigga was saying names. Oh, that nigga don't give a fuck. Yeah, I don't be caring. Dude, he got me when he butted at the camera. Like, Damn, stay. Oh, like, okay. oh my gosh. Okay. Her boyfriend like four feet tall now too. She got a man. Like four feet tall. <laughs> no picture. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> James got no picture either. But James ain't four feet tall. I was be doing nothing. First of all, I didn't try to bring you into it. Nah, <laughs> Anyways, you know what I'm saying? Are you a cheater? Am I a cheater? Of course not. <laughs> nah, nah, these niggas make me laugh. I'm not a cheater. If I if I truly want to fuck someone else, I'm gonna just end it with you. Oh my goodness. That that is that's I mean, that's what that's, that's see, that, this is one thing. This is another thing I gotta say. Females swear, oh, if you're gonna fuck somebody else, just end it with me. I already do that. But then, if I'm like, I'm not feeling you no more, then you get mad as fuck. Like, that is true. Is that like, not what you asked for? That's true. I feel him on that. Because, like, why would you tell me, oh, I understand if you do this, but at least tell me before you do this and that. All right, I'll tell you, and then you get mad. And what was the whole point of telling me, nigga? I could have just. Cause I don't really want y'all to do it. Yeah, really they, they, they say it. They do acting okay, crazy. They don't want you to. They don't want to break but, up. But you do not have no feelings for this girl no more. So what is the problem? Right. You have no yeah. feelings for her. Yeah. So what you what you what you obligated to do for it? You got no feelings for it. Did you go still okay. her? Okay, I see you on that one. My okay, feeling. I understand. Nah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not gonna just say okay. I still got feelings for this girl. I'm finna fuck that bit. I mean, dump, dump her, fuck that bit, and then try to get back with her. No, like I don't think you're saying that. No, he just said he didn't have no feelings for her. Dang, man. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I ain't no dog ass nigga. Like, I'm not finna just not just. <laughs> <laughs> he is really like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry to Maybe I am a dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe I am. Uh, his nickname is J Dog. That's what I'm saying. We really do be calling you J Dog. But I am. Two, two, three, three, I, I, I know how to show some some sympathy to females. I'm not gonna just drop you for no reason. I mean, I'm not like that. I mean, yeah, people just people lose feelings okay, sometimes. Yes, I got a question for y'all. Okay, because you say what is the question for the horse? Like, huh? <laughs> 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 sympathy. You say you show sympathy. I don't really. I don't really. <laughs> catch you as a, like a showing any type of emotion type of person so like what's the most romantic thing yeah I've ever done? I, the most romantic thing i'm sorry to speak for him but this nigga bought a female a pie that wasn't that was <laughs> that was that was a whole full like okay, a whole pie. it was in, a, in a brand new double bag right. it wasn't even washed <laughs> hey, hey. It's whoever, a sticker who, on the who, whoever editing this zoom in to me right now <laughs> i am the only nigga in ninth grade to get his female something. This nigga had a girlfriend, Julius. Didn't get her shit. <laughs> Rodney had a girlfriend at the time. I was broke. Didn't get her shit. I was broke. James, I, he's lonely, so. Bro, why you on this? Hell, I don't be doing nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't be doing nothing. But he. You just left 
me out of it. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm saying, like, I didn't even have a girlfriend. They ain't show, <laughs> they ain't they ain't show no sympathy like, to they female. They ain't give them a shit. Like, damn, you ain't gonna get a bitch shit. Bro, it's night, bro. We have no money. And it wasn't even my idea to put it in a duffel bag. It was my fucking dad. Like, what the fuck? I look like buying this bitch a fucking bag. Like, the fuck am I? <laughs> I, I was thinking about getting this bit some diced pineapples. They didn't have that shit. So my dad said, get a pineapple. The fuck do I look like buying some a uh, whole pineapple? So I just did it because my dad said to do it. I was not I was already thinking about, I already knew what I wanted to get her. I wanted to get her some chocolate covered strawberries, some diced pineapples, and a fucking teddy bear. That was my thing. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> he got, he got no. but, <laughs> And he ended up with a full pineapple, huh? <laughs> <laughs> my, dad, my dad told me to get the pineapple and get the double. <laughs> so I'm like, okay, fuck it. I mean, what, what else? I mean, but like, Shit, ain't nothing nigga beat my ass. That's the last and only time. Nobody beat my ass. What does that have to do with anything? You were just talking about it. Like, I didn't say it like they got a problem with your head. I mean, we can duke it out a little bit. I mean, that's the you know, last and only time I've ever seen you be Ben Sipper Sandy. Man, I just took like, 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 me bit to Atlanta, to Atlanta. Not Atlanta bread. Fucking, uh. Atlanta. Cheesecake Atlanta. Factory. Ooh, Ooh what you pay for it? Hey, I pay for it. She was my girlfriend. Who? 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 That was my hope. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? You tell me to take a bit to Atlanta? Or my you talking about, Atlanta? You talking about eight? Hell no. Nah. I'm talking about eight. Oh, 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 yeah, you did have a girlfriend. Oh, oh I guess you yeah. did have a Okay, that's, the, said, that's the second oh time, I guess. Oh, my God. I mean, thought hey, I'd take my hope to, to fucking Wait, what'd you, what'd you pay for it? Like, what the fuck I look like? Who said that? S? That's an eight. Oh. But he's talking Fair. about S. Fair. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, but you know, I. She said she wanted the fucking the the Lego flower shit. Uh, that shit was like eighty ninety dollars. I paid for that shit. It was all in one day. So it's bread. You got bread. This is like bro. this is like eighty nine ninety nine dollars. So I mean, and then and then on top of that, this she said she wanted a fucking cactus. So I got that bitch. A cactus. You know, like I don't think that's smart, cheap. Smart. Oh yeah, it's, yeah. it's like probably like women. It's not that much. You see him. He's single. He mm-hmm. spends bread. Not spending no bread. <laughs> <laughs> if he likes you, you're not my girlfriend. He's a fucking capper. No, make him that's, your boyfriend. That's James. If you make him your boyfriend, he will. He said you would like her. You pay for it. Oh shit. <laughs> I pay for. <laughs> I pay. I pay for two meals. I paid for three or four meals for the same true. female. That shit was funny when they told me. I told you that. The nigga said he paid for a Waffle House. <laughs> she didn't eat it, and that nigga ate it. <laughs> <laughs> bro, could you not be... Bro, first of all, I'd be hungry anyway, and you gonna want me to pay for your food, and you not even gonna finish it? Yeah, I... He chomped that motherfucker. Oh, I do Yeah. Yo, stay with my game. Hey, ladies, if you, if you ask your man to buy you something, right, and you don't eat the whole thing, why would you ask for that? Because you know how hungry you are before you start, right? Right? Doesn't that make sense? Makes sense. That's what I'm saying. Don't get nothing that you're not going to get. Especially nothing, when, though. That's, what, eat all. that's what I'm saying. Don't ask for to make me spend my money, and you know you're not going to eat it for real just because you want me to get you something. You got me? Chop. Facts. I ate it, though. Good. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, I showed sympathy. You know, like, I had to Did you dress up when you went to Atlanta and all that? Barely, but uh, uh, fucking, I had to get her like a rear turn like every like fucking week. I don't like that. Man, you I, 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 I don't like that. And I still did it, so like, so it's just shit. I have a fucking heart. I do a bit dirty though. Don't get it to you. I'm just saying. Do I'm not only, let I'm that scare you that from that talking to me. Why you would add that? Don't know. <laughs> They're still gonna. Cause I'm just saying, dog. I'm, I'm just letting them know if. They try some sneaky shit on me, I would do you the worst fucking way. I'm just, just like, treating no, him yeah. right. Yeah, just treat me right. I'll He's a brown skin right. with a beard. I ain't brown skin for shit. You brown skin. You not white skin or dark skin. I mean, yeah, no, no. <laughs> I mean you're not, okay, you're right, you're right, you're right. And we're back. That nigga's gonna do shit. This nigga has me. And they come back and find a way to make fun of me. Uh, what's your favorite color? I never asked y'all the question before. What's y'all favorite color? In the comments? Yeah, let us know down in the comments what y'all favorite color is, bro. And don't be no hope. I saw all them views and not one person comment. Actually, comment. 
Hey. You're not too cool to comment. Like. Who do y'all think y'all? No, I mean, that's the I'm just playing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just playing. We like, we, we appreciate every single view and every single like that y'all give. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Let us know in the comments. Let us know down below what you want us to talk about next and all that type of stuff. What y'all want to hear, you know what I'm saying? Trending topics, all that type of stuff. Let us know what we can do better. You know what I'm saying? Let us know what you like about it. You know what I'm saying? All that type of stuff, man. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, before we wrap this up, though. Talk to me. You know, I had to ask you a question. Ask that question, Talk to me, Ask that question. <laughs> it's not that serious of a question. <laughs> ask it. I just want to ask What it. was the most worst experience you have been in in Ohio? It's actually, it's a lot. I don't know. Oh, damn. It's really that bad. <laughs> I've got, just in the past four months, I totaled my car. That was my baby, my Batmobile. I don't even got no whip no more. Totaled my car, knocked my two front teeth out. Got this, got, got these, these hoes. I, I hate them. <laughs> <laughs> I hate them. He has no hoes. <laughs> it's just, it's just, I um, the, the, I love my teammates, but the, they gonna love this episode. <laughs> <laughs> they gonna love this episode. <laughs> The, the, I don't, I don't enjoy, like, I love basketball with all my heart, but I don't enjoy playing that shit in Ohio. Like, that's the first time, being in Ohio is the first time I've ever woken up on a game day and been mad. Mm, see, I, I, I couldn't do like, that. I mean, I never felt that, but, like, if I was in your position, I would have loved to, because, like, how did, how did they make you fall in love out of something that you really love? That's what I'm saying. That's not, that, means, that means it's really bad. Like, that's if you're bad. really passionate about it, they cannot take your drive out. And for them to do that, then they must be doing something wrong down there. Hey, get my nigga fucking starting point guard. Right. This nigga can dunk. Your starting point guard can't dunk. Fat. Fat. Wrong job. This nigga can't him. shoot. Go through a whole press by yourself. And he getting better he and better shoot? every time you see him, twin. Fat. And he got a jumper. Does he got the hose? Right? The hose went just like his jumper. <laughs> 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 Hey, we're out of here. This Whoops. episode is amazing. I love it. This was hey, a pretty good episode. There's like a thousand people like, at my school. It ain't never no party. I, just, I went like I went like seven Saturdays without a party. Oh no! Oh not no! In, not in college. <laughs> my hand. <laughs> it got sharpie. <laughs> <laughs> How the fuck that? Happened? I don't know. Remember that was high, bro? That was. Oh shit. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. we ran out of ideas and went. I didn't know. Hey, Make we sure love y'all, man. Like, comment. And subscribe, share this with a friend, tell them about us, Cozy Boys, all 2022. And this has been the Cozy Boys Podcast. Nigga, you don't do nothing yeah, that you want to do. We're out. Damn, this is my man. He got two shots. Hey, my man, RJ came in in the cut today, you know what I'm saying? I thought you said we got to beat your ass. I'm just. <laughs> <I'm, laughs> the outro. Oh, he don't let me talk. Nigga, you let me talk. Oh, what fuck, you got to say? Fuck, what you got to say? Okay, hey, 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 h